Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about the most technical infrastructure project on the way in Jamaica. This is the extension of the runway at the Norman Manley International Airport into the Kingston Harbor. Now, this is a massive project. In terms of technical skills, Massive project. Probably, I don't think Jamaica has ever done an infrastru infrastructure project like this. So they have hired China Harbor Engineering Company to do this work, to do the project. And when it was announced the project was given to China Harbor Engineering Company, and that's to build a runway into the Kingston Harbor, and that's what we're looking at now. I wondered why they didn't give it to Legion Aviation, who has built runways in Jamaica before. So when we looked into it, we realized that China Harbor Engineering Company... I'm just going to read this section. Checks global reputation as one of the top two dredging contractors in the world made it an ideal choice for this project. Now, I had no idea China Hub Engineering Company was so big, basically, when it comes on to dredging. They own their own ships. The equipment needed, some of the largest dredging ships in the world, China Hub Engineering Company owns it. So this, they were the perfect choice for this project. And you're going to see some massive ships out here soon because they're going to have to dig down to the surface, the bottom of the Caribbean, or the Kingston Harbor, drain out all the silt, everything, and then build it back up, and then compact it so that it stays together, put in walls around it. A massive project. So we'll keep you guys updated on this project. So we're going to go through an article that gives more information on this. China Harbor, sorry, the extension of the runway at the Norman Manley International Airport in Kingston represents one of the most technically ambitious infrastructure projects on the way in Jamaica. At the heart of this venture is the involvement of the China Harbor Engineering Company, a global leader in, mar in marine engineering and dredging whose role underscores both the complexity and international nature of modern infrastructure development on the island. Czech has been contracted to lead the most critical component of the NMIA upgrade, the runway and safety area RESA extension, which requires significant land reclamation into Kingston Harbor. The existing runway, which lies on a narrow palisado spit separating Kingston Harbor from the Caribbean Sea does not currently meet international safety requirements in terms of overrun zones. To meet the International Civil Aviation Organization standards, an additional 300 meters of safety area, 100 meters at each end, is being constructed. The western end of the runway, which just into the harbor, poses particular engineering challenges and calls for expert maritime, expert marine reclamation and dredging, areas where Czech excels. Czech's global reputation as one of the top two dredging contractors in the world made it an ideal choice for this project. As a subsidiary of China Communication Construction Company, Czech has a powerful fleet of dredging vessels and extensive international experience in port and coastal infrastructure projects. From deep water ports in Sri Lanka and Nigeria to land reclamation in Qatar and Panama, Czech's technical and logistical capabilities are well established. In the NMIA runway extension, Czech is responsible for ex <coughs> executing, sorry, in NMIA runway extension, Czech is responsible for executing marine fill operations, seawall reinforcement, and seabed stabilization, 
to allow for the safe extension of the runway over water. Their work includes deploying specialized dredgers to extract and relocate fill material Their work includes deploying specialized dredgers to extract and relocate fill material, building out the landmass needed to support a new pavement structure, and protecting the site from erosion and marine turbulence. This is no ordinary construction project. It requires precise coordination of marine operations, geotechnical engineering, and aviation safety protocols. The runway extension, budgeted at over U.S. $66 million, forms part of a broader U.S. $160 million airport redevelopment being managed by PAC Kingston Airport Limited under a long-term concession from the Government of Jamaica. Checks portion began with mobilization in late 2024 and is expected to continue for approximately three years with completion targeted for mid 2027. Alright guys, that's the end of the update article. And of course, you know we will be giving you regular updates on this project, especially when those massive ships arrive. Czech has already built out an office at the Norman Manor International Airport to oversee this project. Alright guys, enjoy the tour. Remember to like, share and subscribe. Have a good day. Thank you.